Jeff. That was quick. guys what's up man 84 today I, I can get used to this I'm not complaining one bit seems like it took about eight months to get here but summer's kind of here what up Keith Man, Guardians got the vid, got the Rona. That's still a thing. I'm not sure how many games. I know we canceled last night. I think it was more coaches than players. Well, yeah, I probably didn't have a game scheduled today because it's Thursday. Let's see. They play tomorrow in Minnesota. Finest basketball. You heard that correctly. Tops finest basketball. And they're probably they're pumping out as much as they can. It's mo I'm pretty sure it's all old school guys. I put the checklist up. I went over it. But the real easiest break is was to do a pack break because the checklist. Some of the base players didn't have autos, so I couldn't really do it. I didn't want to do a player break, you know. So we, this way, everyone gets a pack. So I'll open it, random, mix up the packs, and then number them 118. And then whatever numbers you picked is the pack you get. Let me print that out real quick. While you guys stumble on in. So the Brownies open up against the Panthers. Man, if somehow Baker does get traded to Carolina and we play them first week, you can't make this stuff up. Right? That'd be amazing if that was the week one matchup. One second, let's not save this. I can't put post. All right, print, print, save. City three. <laughs> Jeff Trojan. We got the Panthers and the Jets. We better be two and zero, but you know we won't. That'd be some shit if Baker goes to the, throws like four touchdowns, Watson has like three interceptions. There's Jimmy. He's hoping for Baker. Oh, and two. <laughs> I can't wait to football season, Jeff. I like going back and forth with you, but it's all good fun until we get those few people in here that get their butts hurt. Alrighty, I put up the list of the packs that you guys will be getting this stuff this product's weird you know like they got Shaq in like a leather jacket Isaiah Thomas in like a fur I mean it's something different so I figured I'd grab a box you know me I'll, I'll try we'll try a box Here we go. Boom. 
Yeah, I know. I know, bro. All right, so pack one will go to Clint. Pack two, Jeff Trojan. Pack three, Jim Curtin. Pack four, Scott. Pack five, PJ. Pack six, Jimmy. Pack seven, Kevin Molner. Pack eight, Jeff Trojan. Pack nine, Curtis. Pack 10, Kevin. Pack 11, Keith. Pack 12, Drew. Drew is not in for the one on one. Only pack. 13, PJ. Pack 14, Brian. Pack 15, Jeff. 16, Mark Money Thomas. 17, Scott. And pack 18, PJ. I appreciate you guys closing the mini out. Getting that full. I'm just clicking all the wrong stuff. There we go. 101. Scrolling by. It's, it's 10, 1080 something, I believe. Here it comes. Do, 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 do. One of one bounty is one, zero, eight, one. One, zero, eight, one. I'm gonna grab some sleeves so then I can put your guys' cards right in a, a bag. That's way it's already be separated. Alrighty. A couple of you have a couple packs, so that'll combine those. Alrighty. I think we're ready now. There is one on ones in this. I checked before uh, I posted. So, good luck. Let's give away some cash. same cards are pretty much the same. Except for maybe there's a couple of refractors and then it calls for one on card chrome auto. And now we number Joe, no, it's all old school. It is literally all old school, and they're wearing funky ass coats and leather jackets because you know it's not licensed. So I had to try it at least once. 
Yeah, I said not last for least. <laughs> I'm backwards. Keith, uh, yeah, whatever pack. Yeah, whatever pack you. So you hit. You chose eleven. So pack eleven is yours. It just, just was a hard product to break, but I wanted to try it, so I figured everyone gets a pack. Let's do it that way. All right. Du, 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 du. Wait till you see some of these guys. They're just funny. I looked up some of them. All right, pack one going to Clint. Mr. Clint. Clint, Clint. Number one. Oh, no. Alan Houston on top. Remember him? Oh, we got color. Larry Johnson on a purple. That is going to be 85 out of 250. Larry Johnson. Dude, I used to have a ton of his upper deck rookies. I probably still do somewhere. Vladi Divac. And Kenny Anderson. So Clint hits the first refractor color. Look at how big that dude's hand is. I want to get smacked with that. So we'll show this one off. So I'll write Clint and put a little tag so I know it doesn't hit his permit. So Larry, 85 out of 250, Larry Johnson. Oh, yeah, remember, Grant? You remember that? Yeah, I just, that brings back a lot of, those commercials are great. Two, throw it up. Oops. Jeff Trojan. Number two. Joe Smith. Starting us off with a little Joe Smith. Remember that guy? Scott Burrell. That one looks a little more shinier. Might be a refractor. Sean Kemp. <laughs> These cards are funny. That is a refractor for Scott Burrell. Sean Kemp and Dennis Rodman man that that goes through back a couple old school guys so the Burrell was a refractor Jeff you're up again a couple times I believe Scott Burrell Trojan. So I'll forget Jeff T. Dude, that's that's why I, that's why I had to break it, Vinny. <laughs> so, dude, they're different, man. I, that's when I said I got I gotta get a box, and I was on tops because, dude, I bought this like two and a half weeks ago, and I was like. I emailed them and I paid the extra like six bucks to get it shipped sooner. And like they didn't mail it to like last week. And I'm like, dude, I I bought this over two or two and a half weeks ago. 
Because I want to break it, man. All right, Jeff Chosen, there's your first pack. All right, pack three is going to Jim Sauce Curtin. Jimmy Curtin. Uh, Vinny, 14, 15 with the 101, 18 spots. So everyone gets a pack. All right, pack three, Jim Curtin. Good luck. It's really the only way I can really break it because all the players don't have autos. So I didn't want to do a player break. There is a couple guys in here, you're like, who the hell is that? Like Ando Foil. Adonal. I said Andal. Adonal Foil. Jimmy, who's that? I know you might probably know who that is. Larry Johnson. It's just a regular. Dan Marley. I used to love Dan Marley. Dude, I had his Phoenix Suns jersey when I was growing up. Dude, Vinny, that would be great if we pulled Mutombo. And BJ Armstrong from the Bulls, from what I remember him. I don't think that's a refractor, so um, nothing special in that pack. So those were just But they're still nice cards. I mean they did as they did the best they could with it not being licensed. I think. It's different. Some guys I saw some guys that didn't like them, but I think it's it was pretty cool. He played basketball. <laughs> Let's see what it says on the back of this card. Let's see. He was eighth pick in the 1997 draft. Wow. St. Vincent and the gr Grenades. Golden State, it said. Leader in blocks. Huh. Oh, let me call him. All right, Jim Curtin, that was your pack. Oh, that's a wicked. All right. What are we on? Four? Four. Scotty. Scotty F. Four, that marker started to rub off. I guess I should have let it dry a little bit before I... That's a, it's all right. They're in order anyway. Starting us off, Randy Brown. Color coming. Randy Brown. Steve Nash looks to be gold. Nine out of 50. Steve Nash, that's sweet. That is pretty cool. Anthony Hardaway, dude, I loved this dude growing up. I had his shoes, little penny. He had it all, dude. Anthony Hardaway. That'd be sweet to get an auto out of this. And John Starks, not a bad pack, dude. That's that was a lot of players that I followed growing up. That Steve Nash is pretty sweet. Penny. A little penny. Those are some good commercials too. They don't make commercials like that anymore. Not like they used to. Nine out of fifty. Just hold your horses, Keith. You might have an auto. <laughs> I appreciate that, though. Dylan will get a kick out of it. Now let me write Scott's name on that one so I don't. All right, all right, Scott. That was you have another pack coming, but that one's pretty good. Number four. So number five. PJ. PJ in the house. Oh, I got one. Oops. Can't 
forget about Randy Brown. Randy Brown. I know I've heard that name, Randy Brown. Chicago, yeah. Yeah, that's where I remember him from, the Bulls era. All right, five. PJ. Turn us off. Hershey Hawkins. Atlanta, right? I think he played for a while, if I recall. Willie Anderson. Vinny Del Negro. Man, they're really throwing some names back. And last, Damon Stoudemire. Okay. Stoudemire, man. They thought he was going to be a lot greater than he was. He was still good. PJ, there's your. I think you hit a mini, so I think you got another pack coming. Mighty Mouse Sotomayor. <laughs> Man, this is bringing up a lot of memories for me, too, Vinny. That's crazy. All right, we got to pull the Isaiah Thomas in the fur coat. It's badass. All right, six, six. Yeah, he did. He did. <laughs> yes, he did. Jim Jennings, of course, number six. Yes, he did have a Muddy Mouse tattoo. Jimmy. Jason Richardson starting us off. Jay Rich. Dirk! Man, if that would have been auto, that would have been badass. Dirk! Dennis Hobson. And your fourth card, Isaiah Ryder. Remember that kid, dude? He was supposed to be the man. Or was it UNLV? Was, did he go to school, I think? He was supposed to be the next best, you know, whatever. Dennis Hobson. He went to Ohio State? I thought he did. Not sure who he played for. It didn't say there, but I, I can remember the name. Something. Dirk. That would have been sweet if that was Dotto. All right, seven, number seven, seven, seven. Kevin Molner. Number seven. Number seven. Yeah, the NBA is just not like how it used to be. Is that a Horace Grant? It is. Horace Grant. They, they should have had him in his goggles. They should have had him in his goggles. Oh, there's a refractor. Earl Boykins. I think he played for the Cavs for a little bit. He, he was a tiny dude, I believe. That's a refractor. Tim Hardaway. And Latrell Sprewell. That was a sweet pack. At least for my memories. Yeah, Keith. Yeah, you're right, dude. It's definitely that error. I think there's a couple that might be after that, but not many. Earl Boykins, Refractor. Oh, he was born in Cleveland, Ohio. I did not know that. Yeah, 5'5", 133. Earl Boykins.
All right, number eight. Jeff Trojan. What do you got? You got three packs, Jeff? You do, sir. Yeah, you hit one in the mini. So let's grab your Jeff Trojan. So throw that all together. Ron Harper. Ron Harper. There's a Cavalier that I watched. I think you got some color. 25 out of 75. Latrell Sprewell. Looks to be on the purple. That's sweet. 25 out of 75. Latrell Sprewell. Jeff Hornacek. <laughs> and. Oh, God. Okay, you got two Ron Harpers. Come on, Tops. Oh, wah, wah, wah. Same pack. Well, at least you hit a numbered card, Jeff. A little spree well. I was going to say it's kind of purple, kind of pink. 25, 75. So that's three color. I don't know if there's more than that. Uh, they said average was three color. No, oh, wait. Just me. I'm sorry, I have to go back and look. Well, I'll forget it. Still looking for that auto. All right, Jeff, you got one more shot. <clears throat> A little bit later, huh? That was eight. Pack nine. Curtis. I believe. Curtis, number nine. Okay, so here's one of the younger kids, Cole Anthony. So they did throw a couple, a few guys from this era. Allen Iverson, gangster. Look at that. That's sweet. Jawan Howard. Looks like recently from his coaching days. And Tim Hardaway. No refractor or number than that. Still some cool names popping up. A little AI. And the Cole Anthony. So we did get a, a younger. All right, Curtis. All right, halfway done. Number 10. Do, 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 do. That will be Kevin Molner. So let's find Kevin's pack. All right, good luck, Kevin. Number 10. Kurt Rambis. <laughs> Kurt Rambis. Jeff Hornacek. So now we're starting to see some doubles. Earl Boykins and Corey Blount, 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 or the Heap. What's that? The game's biggest superstar and famous frozen moment commercial in 1997. Oh yeah, the Bulls. Pretty sure, right? All right, Kevin. <clears throat> Some of these cards have one, have the Panini Bend do it a little bit. The Panini Prism Bend or Mosaic. All right, number 11 is Keith. You're up, sir.
number 11. Robert Horry starting us off. And a Gary Payton. That's numbered. It's sparkly. I think you'll want that, Keith. 76 out of 199. It's a pretty cool looking card. 76 out of 199. Kevin Garnett. And BJ Armstrong. So that was a cool Gary Payton for sure. Thought maybe it might have been the auto. That's right. Gary Payton, right? He's a glove. Mike, did we hit one Iverson? Just, uh, just a base. I think it was just the last pack. He's got a gangster chain on and a fedora. <laughs> oh, this shit's funny. All right, so. Not bad hit to keep. A little Gary Payton. Number 12. Drew. Drew is not in for the 101. Number 12, Drew. Oh, let me get here. Let me get this ready just so I have it. There's a method to my madness. Just so I don't have to sort them ready. They're already ready to go. <clears throat> There's another dirt. Got some color. Dennis Rodman, ooh, orange, 14 out of 25. That's a sweet card, Drew. No auto yet, Vinny. 14 out of 25, a little shorter print. Orange Dennis Rodman. Mutombo, there he is. There he is. And Brad Sellers. There's one of those, like, you're like, huh? So that's a cool pack. Not in my house. No, no. Dennis Rodman, orange, 14 out of 25. So there's more than just three colors. Because that's our fourth fourth color, and then we have like the sparkly one. So it, it's not, it's more than what they said. Unless we just got lucky. But I, I don't know if that will happen. All right, Drew, there you go, sir. Let me write your name on this one so I just don't forget. All right, 13. PJ. PJ had a pack already, right? There you are. All right, PJ. 13 kind of rubbed off, but it's, they've all been over. <clears throat> I didn't let it dry before I said no. Clint, you were the first pack, bro. Jawan Howard. We got a refractor of James Worthy. James Worthy Refractor. Come on. It's right in the middle there. Oh, there's the auto. And it's Corey Blount. That snuck up on me. It's, it was hard to see. So PJ gets the auto. And it's Corey Blount. I didn't even realize it was auto because it it's like blue. It was 
very hard to see. Is that on card? They are on card. Why couldn't have been a better auto? Well, PJ, you hit the auto, sir. Pack 13 it was. And then you had a Dan Marley. <clears throat> that would have been sweet if it was the worthy that was autoed. But he's the refractor. Still can get some color left. In, right. That one's messed up. Brian is up. 14 for Brian. Let's pull that 101 refractor. Alan Houston. Steve Smith. Joe Smith. What's, who's next? What Smith? Jerome Lane. Wow. Look at that chain. It was balling. Jerome Lane. So those are all your basic base. No color or refractor in that pack. Fifteen. I think this is Mr. Trojan's third pack from the mini. It is number fifteen. Stoudemire. A blue. It's going to be ninety-nine out of one fifty. A Vince Carter. That's badass. 99 out of 150 of Vince Carter. That's a sweet hit. If you didn't hit an auto, at least you hit that. That's pretty cool. I just loved Vince, so maybe it's just me. But I think that's a sweet card. Willie Anderson and Vinny. Hell yeah. That's what, that's what I thought, Jeff. That is sick. Hell yeah. I thought it was... I thought it was Allen Iverson at first, but I was like, wait, no, he had a fedora. So 99 out of 150 on the Vince. That's definitely the second best card, I think, to the auto. If you, It might even be a little bit better than the auto. Hell yeah, he's the best dunker of all time. Dude was nasty. So yeah, there's definitely way more than three refract colored refractors that it said in the description of the box. Because we got like one, two, three, four, five, plus three regular refractors. Let me find your pack, Mr. Jeff Trojan. Alright, number 16. This is Mr. Mark Money Thomas. Number 16. Start us off. Steve Smith. Oh, another numbered. 7 of 15. Who is it going to be? Sean Kemp! 
That's nasty. 7 out of 15 strong camp. That looks kind of blackish. That is short print. They're teasing us. A Sean Kemp 7 out of 15. He looks thrilled, but that's sweet. These cards are winning me over. Larry Nance Sr. How fitting. Mark grew up in the area around me. Was a Cavs fan. A little Larry Nance Sr. And Scott Burrell. That was a sweet pack, brother. Sean Kemp had 12 kids, was it? Or something crazy. Man, Larry looking old, huh? I was I wish we would have kept his son though. I'd like him. But we got we had too many bags, he had to go. But yeah, that's nice. Seven out of fifteen. So there's definitely more numbered cards than what was in the description, I guess. Yeah, you call this black. That's cool. Vince Carter, Sean Kemp, and Rodman up front. That's that's a lineup right there. 17, I think this is going to be Scott's second pack. It is. 17. Let me find your, your pack. PJ, you're next. Looks like you're there. Where is Scotty? Probably the last one. There he is. Oh, let me throw marks. That pack too. Getting ahead of my ass, myself with that Sean Kemp. Scott, 17 left. Joe Dumars, first we saw of him. Ooh, 47 out of 299, a little cracked ice. Of Cole Anthony, that's a good one. Cole Anthony with the Cracked Ice Edition. Man, these, these are pretty sweet cards. I don't care what anyone says. Another Corey. It's been a Corey kind of day, I guess. And Kukoc. Tony. He just got a casual sweater on. Well, that Cole Anthony Cracked Ice is nice. Thought it might have been shorter print. I saw some guy. He said this was the first product I've opened in. Four years and I'm like man it's that bad I don't think it's that bad I mean you know I mean you saw the checklist what were you thinking you were gonna get you know so Scott nice cool landing 47 out of 299 there's a couple lines on there print lines I guess uh yes you did yep that Nash is yours too 9 out of 50 on the Nash. So you had, you had a couple good packs, I would say. <clears throat> Last pack, PJ. Can we get one more color, maybe? I'm just going to put it here. Oh. No, I'll write down it because I'll have to recap after. I, mean, I should be able to remember it now. We're almost done. Alright, last pack. PJ. 18. Another spree roll. Uh, no color on this this back. Larry Hughes. I remember Larry Hughes. Another Vince base and a Sean Kent. So we had a couple doubles in that one. All right, guys. That was a fun break. That was cool. The Sean Kemp 7 of 15. Vince Carter, 99 out of 150 in blue. The auto could have been a little better. I wish it wasn't Corey Blanc, but 
Crack dice. We'll do a recap of those hits real quick. I appreciate the fill, guys. It's a little different. We're, we had a little different kind of breaks this past couple, but it's good to mix it up, you know, and I wanted to break at least a box of this just because it, because I saw it, and I'm like, I have to break a box of it just because it, it's pretty cool, I think. There's some older guys that are, grew up in the same time as me, so they know a lot of these guys, I'm pretty sure. All right. We will do a recap of the <clears throat> numbered or in refractor. The other color was Larry Johnson. So yeah, the number cards, we had some sweet, sweet players. All right. Earl Boykins was a refractor. That went to Kevin. It was right in the middle there. Refractor. Scott Burrell. Refractor. That was going to Jeff. The auto, Corey Blount. That was PJ. I didn't write on there, but I remember PJ. It hit the auto. Kind of snuck up on me. Latrell Spreeball. 25 out of 75 on that one. So call that like a pink purple. That went to Jeff. Dennis Rodman. 14 out of 25. Drew. Hit that one on the orange. Sweet card. The Cole Anthony cracked ice, 47 out of 299. Went to Scott. Larry Johnson, purple, 85 out of 250. That went to Clint. Vince Carter, blue, 99 out of 150. Who was Vince Carter? That was Jeff Trojan. I didn't write that down, but I got you for that. Steve Nash, that was Scott, and that was 9 out of 50. Sparkly, 76. Out of 199, that was Keith. And then the Sean Kemp Black, 7 out of 15, going to Mr. Mark Money Thomas. It's pretty cool. All right, guys, I appreciate the fill. Jeff, I'm going to write that on there now, it's just so I don't. Okay. <clears throat> All right, boys. I was hoping like it was a different product, so maybe the 101 was in there. So I gotta look and see what's going up next. I'm not sure yet. But I will put a preview up tomorrow. I think it might be the other box of Don Ross clearly. And then I have Don Ross baseball, so we'll see. All right guys, that's it for tonight. Appreciate the fill, the stuff was fun. And we'll go, we'll try to give away the cash this weekend. I'm trying. Might have to go grab some old school boxes. Those seem those seem to hit when we we get the pots up there, so we'll see. All right, guys, that's it for tonight. Appreciate it. I'll talk to you guys soon. Later. Have a good one.